Hello fellow game collectors. This is my new mini series. This is my quest for N64. I'm trying to get a complete N64 collection. Uh, there are 296 North American N64 titles. I'm currently about halfway there, uh, not including what I'm going to show you today. I'm at 149 N64 games. Uh, I'm mainly just focusing on carts, not necessarily complete in the box, but if I do find one complete in the box, then I will, I will get it. Uh, so let's get started. Um, my, the first two games I'm going to show you I got from uh, Edward McKay, which is a local used bookstore, music, and video games. Uh, so video, uh, N64 number 150 is uh, F1 Pole Position 64. Uh, it was complete in the box. Uh, it says that it's $8. I actually paid $6 for it because uh, one of the stickers said $6, so they gave it to me at that price. Uh, the box is in pretty decent shape. Uh, the card itself looks uh, like it's never been played. It's the, there's no marks on it. I mean, it was it was completely clean before I even started cleaning it. The pins looked good and everything. Um, and it also includes uh, the manual, which is in pretty good shape, and an insert. F1 pole position. Uh, it, it's an okay uh, racing game. Uh, if you like formula racing, you might like it. Uh, it's it's got that um, something that you see in a lot of racing games where the lead the lead uh, racer driver in the race gets very far ahead of everyone else. Um, I found I found it very easy to get to second place, but it was pretty difficult to get to first place uh, in my playthrough. It um, it has a lot of tracks in it, but they kind of look the same because you know it's N64 graphics, so it's using a lot of the same textures and nothing that really makes it identifying. But it, it, it's a pretty decent racer uh, if you're interested in picking up a, an actual racing game, formula racing game. So number 151 was Madden 99. Uh, it was only 75 cents. Uh, I wouldn't get much better at a yard sale. Uh, not a lot to say about it. It's, it's another Madden game. Um, football, nothing too special about it. Uh, the card itself, uh, it's in okay condition. There's a little bit of marking on the back. Uh, the, pin, the pins definitely had to be cleaned. And then uh, the last game I have to show, number 152, uh, is Super Bowling. Uh, a little bit of damage on the back, but um, I got this game for my birthday. Um, it's, uh, it actually holds its value. It's kind of an uncommon game. Uh, I think the current value is about $30 for this game. Um, but it's a sports game. It, it's it's not really a great bowling game. It's okay. It's decent. Um, nothing really special about it for it to be valued so much other than just rarity. So keep your eye out for that one. Um, I, I was surprised whenever I got it that it was actually worth that much. Uh, so that's all I got for now. Uh, I, every, whenever I get more in 64 games, I'll create another uh, mini series of this. And um, you may still see some of the N64 games in my other video game pickups, but I, I will always show them in this until I get all the N64 games because I do want a full collection. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you like this, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment down below if you have if you want to say anything about any of these three games, if they're any good or not. And uh, be sure to subscribe. And remember, you got to get the power up to beat the game.